Hola and bienvenidos everybody. If you don't know who I am, my name is Nitpick and today we're going to do another reaction to Voice of Bociprot. So the reason why I want to do this reaction is because I got a lot of recommendations after the first video and I was extremely excited when I saw that there was a cover of Killing in the Name of by Rage Against the Machine. So needless to say, I love Rage. So we're gonna jump into that, but before we do that, if you like the channel, please like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Also, if you're interested, I got a Patreon. There's a link in the description down below. You can also join for free just to kind of like see what's happening, see what I'm doing. Anyway, let's jump in to this cover. I'm so excited. Hold on, man, what? So, okay, this may not be the best recording and that's not their fault. That, I think that's mainly a, like the price that was paid to like record this concert. And it's like, they didn't quite record everything of their instrument quite well. I think it definitely could be louder. Also, can we just talk about how well they're doing so far? <laughs> Rage has four members, but their fourth member is purely a vocalist. Tom Morello takes care of the guitar playing, right? But, and everyone else, like we have our bassist and our guitarist, but these ladies are taking on a challenge where they're having to fill in the job of the vocalist as one of them who's already playing guitar so this is really cool so far we're gonna we're gonna skip all that intro because they don't start playing until at least 20 seconds in <laughs> <laughs> I love how the audience is like, yeah! Dude, yeah. This is sick! Also... 
Can we talk about how her voice here in a little bit really starts to match the energy of rage? <sighs> yeah! Kill it in the name of! <laughs> No, like what? You can tell that she's like, there's a lot of work being done. So like, she's like, I'm, I'm playing, I'm having to sing this. And then what's nice is that the audience is filling in some for her. Rage was really known for like sticking it to the man. Let's talk about <laughs> groups that talk about freedom and having like bo uh, bodily autonomy or just autonomy in general, like Alanis Marset, very, like a lot of her music was angry. She's an angry woman and I love her music. Her music gets me going, man. They, this band kind of reminds me of that. They just want to be who they are and be musicians. And like, there's another song that I want to react to eventually. We'll get to that. I just really wanted to do something that was out of the originals of what they do. It's just cool that they're covering a song that a band did that was known to do it to stick it to the man. So it's cool. And she's rising to the occasion. Let's go back a little bit. I want to get to the the part where she's actually singing. Let me see if I can find it. Okay. <laughs> this is a stark difference from her voice in the god allow me to make music but get it i love it i kind of wish they would turn her mic up a little bit That is sick. Like the stage presence. She's just like, what's up? You hear me? She's like pointing out the stage presence that she's just like pointing to people like, answer me. I love it. Hold on, let's go back a little bit. I love her anger. That's right. 
Show him, girl. And the drummer. <laughs> And her rage! Dude, that audience is loving this. They're going so hard, the camera's breaking. She's drumming barefoot. Get it, girl. about this okay so i was wondering i was like for a minute i was like she's a is she really gonna go all tom morello on us is she gonna try and do the tom morello solo and she didn't but like the way they tr they they changed it up so it's cool so there are things that i like about covers and what i do like about covers is that the artist that is covering the other some most of the time like they make it their own right so they try and make, change it up a little bit in this case they changed up a decent amount which actually makes it pretty cool instead of having like the tom morello woo -wee, woo -wee, woo -wee, solo they ended up having do you like my impression <laughs> anyway um they started with the bass solo and then she they like What's cool is they slowed down the song for a second, but kept the beat. And then as well as like the guitar solo being in a half time, the drums being in a half time, but the bass was in double time. It's really neat. I do not know how far to go back. Yeah, right here. So right now you think it's gonna go in a, like double time? And I'm sorry. What in the funk? <laughs> like, that... I love this funk. Dude, the slapping! And then all of a sudden... Uh, 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 uh. Drums go in halftime. But the bass is in. Guitar is in halftime. Killing it. <laughs> yeah, girl. Yeah, girl. Tell them. And she flips the bird, doesn't she? Yes, Queen! Yes! You won't do what you tell me!
dude. So this was extremely epic. It's nice to see, like, okay, reasons why I really like this band. The female rage just comes through 100%. And these ladies don't give, they don't care what who they upset or whatever, like whoever is mad. They're just having fun, making music, and they should. They should have that right. And I guarantee you a lot of people in their lives, like, told them, don't do this kind of thing. It's not, it's frowned upon, and they're, they're doing it. They're making it happen, and good for them. I, this is, this band is extremely underrated. I feel like they need to be exposed more, like, there needs to be more about them out there and i guess this is part of the job of like also doing reactions like telling people like hey check this out because they're actually really good it's really really good stuff i love these ladies after all that female rage and me getting all hyped up <laughs> let's continue the conversation about music down in the comments what do you think of voice of bachi prot what do you think of this cover and remember, it's okay to not like something. Just be nice about it, you know? There's no need to be mean about it, but whatever, it's the internet. <laughs> but yeah, tell me what you think I missed. Tell me what I should listen to next. What's the next journey? Also, if you like my YouTube channel, please like and subscribe. And if you wanna check out the Patreon, there's a link down below, click on it. It's free to join, hang out. It's fun, it's fun there. I will see you in the next video. Peace out. Ha <laughs> ha.